here are three concepts that you need to be aware of in order to properly understand your ex and the downfall of your relationship. So the first one is intimacy attachment style. Most people know this by now. They're reading, uh, if maybe you read the book Attached, um, you start to understand who's anxious versus who's avoidant versus who's secure. And if you're watching this video and you're somewhat anxious, maybe you've overdone it with your otherwise secure partner or uh, maybe your partner is avoidant, which even further made you overdo it. The second concept is stress response. Inevitably in the relationship, both you and your partner um, are gonna come into some kind of stressful scenario, either work, school, family, like whatever the case is. And you need to understand what is your knee jerk reaction in these situations. For example, someone breaks in the house and you're the man. Do you fight him? Do you run away? Do you just give him your wallet? Like, what do you do? Likewise, if you're a female, what is your stress response? If, if a, a male individual raises his voice at you, how do you react to that? Do you punch him in the face? Do you get out of there? Do you just comply with whatever it is that they're saying? So by understanding your stress response and your partner's, you can wade into future discussions if you reattract your ex with a little bit more intelligence. Lastly, what is your conflict style? So for example, who is the one that brings stuff up? Who is the one that typically would be content to not bring anything up and sweep it under the rug? And you know, if that's you, then you need to work on essentially being willing to stay in those situations a little bit longer, right? Or, or, you know, ask for the time that you need to cool off, etc. And then if it's you that, you know, if you're the approacher, then you need to have a little bit of compassion for the other person in those circumstances as well. When you can assess all three of these concepts in relation to you and your partner in that relationship dynamic that you had, you can get a little bit more intelligence on how to move forward in the future once you've reattracted them, for example, through my methods of no contact and all the other things I teach in my videos. Now, if you wanna assess where you stand, where your partner stands and kinda of tell me some of the relationship history that you had with your partner and get some intelligence on how to move forward, including how to reattract them, uh, click into my profile and then click this link down here and get in touch with me and let's have a conversation about your exact situation.